Yeah. But everybody, it is time to crack open our show vault and share something we've never shown before today. Earlier this year, Hollywood power couple Nick Offerman and Megan Mullally dialed in uh, from separate rooms of the same house. That's a real true thing. Uh, Megan and I got to talking about how we got started in music, um, and she shared some pretty revealing things, so check it out. I feel like all people, like no matter what part of the industry you're in, um, we all started in like musical theater, like when we were kids and doing stuff like that. Did you do that? Did you start in like musical theater when you were young? I did. I um, I loved, I used to sing when my, my parents would go out and I'd put on um, Barbara Streisand and Judy Garland records because apparently my parents were a gay male couple. <laughs> Um, and I would just like sing one song over and over again until I could sing it exactly like the record. And then when I was in, um, the first time I sang in public, I, w I was a senior in high school and we, I went to this Episcopalian school, private school, and they, we had chapel every day, which is so bizarre and embarrassing. And, um, so I, I was encouraged by the people who like, did such things to get up in front of the entire high school and belt out three show tunes, which I did. And I was incredibly nervous and it ended up going well, but I, I had choreographed a song from the musical Chicago called Razzle Dazzle. And, yeah. and during it, I would go, I went over and sat on the principal's lap, which was like a huge, crazy thing to do at the time. And then Nick and I were just in Oklahoma City recently, and we actually found the cassette tape of me singing that. What? Which is, yeah, it's crazy. That is yeah. so cool. I randomly, uh, my, I think it was my mom that said, oh my God, I randomly found a VHS of like me doing something like in high school. And I was like, what? That's what, and I'm the same as you. I used to memorize stuff like that. Like I would sing Don't Rain on My Parade. Like I sang it so much. I wanted to sing it exactly like That's the like first Barbara. song I sang. Wait, that's oh. the first song I sang in chapel. That's my favorite. I literally, when I was at Radio City Music Hall and we were on tour and I cover songs all the time, I was like, I will cover this song in this place and it will be magical. I love, I love oh her so God. much. No, that's a great that's one. That's crazy. The first song I sang was Don't Run On My Parade. Then I sang People oh. and then Razzle Dazzle from Chicago. But they're all, not Razzle Dazzle as much, but Don't Run On My Parade and People are really hard songs to sing, you yes. know, for your first time. It's like where to breathe and Don't Run On My Parade. I also secretly love that you kind of gave your either teacher or principal a lap dance. Um, and <laughs> it was kind of amazing. It was early days. I mean, lap dance, the word... <laughs> Lap dances have been invented. <laughs> you, see, he invented rap and you invented lap dances. You are the perfect couple.